Dock crew sorting out a breakdown. Parramatta Road, City Bound, near Brigatta Road. Lane 1 is impacted in Double Bay. Lights on the flash. New South Head Road at Cura Road. All directions affected there. And the do some roadworks on the Sydney Harbour Bridge. Some maintenance work. Lanes affected each way. And the speed limit is down to 40 kilometres an hour. It's Super Weekend online and in store at Maya today. Save 20% off the original price of toys. Exclusions and conditions apply. Hurry in and shop at Maya. Offers end today. I'm Tim Govis with the latest traffic. Moon Man in the morning has landed. 6 to 9 a.m. weekdays on 104.9 Triple M. For over four weeks, Triple M phones have been ringing off the chain. One million dollars cash. All to win one million dollars. Put a deposit on a house. I'll be a boat and a truckload of bait. I'll get travelling. Everything else, I just want to leave. Oh, I'd love to be a millionaire. Make money, money, make money, money, money. Triple M's millionaire listener. The clock is ticking. Yeah, I'm living life in the fast lane. Sydney's millionaire listener will be named Wednesday at 8 a.m. Couldn't even imagine a million dollars. That is spelled millionaire with a Triple M. Big gigs are calling. New customers can sign up to get a total 45 gig with 35 days to use it, only on Vodafone Prepaid. Then you can upload, download and stream all your favourite pics, flicks and shows. That's big gigs for more days with Vodafone's $40 Prepaid Combo Plus starter pack. Ready? Offer ends and must be activated by April 30, 2019. Includes 20 gig plus 25 gig of bonus data, T's and C's apply. Jet Summer of Fitness just got better. Get started with $0 joining fee, saving $89, plus a free four-week training program. Work out on your terms with no locking contracts and 24-7 access to all Jets gyms. Join online or drop into your local Jets to get started with $0 joining fee, saving $89, plus a free four-week training program. T's and C's apply. Offer ends Thursday. The Australian Government is investing in transport infrastructure as part of a 10-year, $75 billion commitment to support our nation. Right across New South Wales, the Australian Government is making significant investments in hundreds of projects to deliver faster, safer connections. To learn more about this Australian Government-funded commitment and see New South Wales projects happening close to you, visit the website. Search Building Our Future. Authorised by the Australian Government, Canberra. In the real world, people are self-employed, work shifts, get sick, get divorced, all of which often leads to getting refused a loan by the banks. But at Pepper Money, they don't put people in boxes. They look at each person's situation individually, and if they can help, they will. That's why Pepper Money is Australia's leading non-bank. Calculate your borrowing power online right now or talk to a broker about Pepper Money. Real-life loans for real people. Eligibility criteria applies. One three hundred rubbish. The only professional rubbish removal service that is always reliable. This is Triple M, Sydney's one hundred four point nine. Hey there, I'm Joseph Ogilvy. Twenty-eight people rescued in waters off southeast Queensland yesterday as ex-tropical cyclone Omar stirred up massive seas. The Bureau recorded a huge nine-metre wave off the Gold Coast. While the now tropical low isn't expected to cross the coast, rough surf conditions will likely continue throughout the week, along with the potential for damaging winds. A man has died after apparently climbing on the roof of a Gold Coast church and falling through a skylight. Police were called to Hamilton Avenue in Surface Paradise around 2 this morning to find the 23-year-old deceased, a report's being prepared for the coroner. Four people have died in the space of 14 hours on Victorian roads. The latest, an 18-year-old cyclist hit by a truck near Portland in the state's southwest last night. That followed three fatal crashes around Melbourne yesterday. And American singer R. Kelly will have to fork out $1.4 million for bail after being charged with 10 counts of aggravated criminal sexual abuse. M. Sport. In the A-League, Wellington Phoenix coach Mark Gruden has blown a gasket at his own club after a 1-0 loss to Sydney FC. The match was meant to be a home game, but officials said they couldn't find a suitable stadium in New Zealand and instead opted to play the match at Campbelltown. I made it quite clear to the football club how I felt about playing in Sydney, which should have been a home game for us. I'll just leave it at that. And I also said... He better not come back to bite us as well. In yesterday's other match, it was a one-all draw in the Melbourne derby between the victory and City.
And to cricket, after leaving Aussie shores demoralised, Sri Lanka has staged arguably the biggest victory in the country's history, becoming the first Asian team to win a series on South African soil. The tourists claim the silverware after notching an eight-wicket victory in the second match of the series in Port Elizabeth. Tonight on 10, there'll be crazy pranks, epic stunts and mega prizes. Extend your weekend with Sunday Night Takeaway. Premieres live, 7.30 tonight on 10. Overcast and a possible shower today, 20 for the top. Cloudy again tomorrow, a top of 25. Mostly fine Tuesday, a top of 27. Thank you. 